Hello everybody. Sorry, I haven't worn a um, mic-friendly outfit, it would seem. <laughs> but I'm finally all good if I think I'm plugged in. Um, first of all, I'm having a fantastic day because I just found out I'm technically just a millennial. Woo! I'm going to tell everyone that's been the highlight of the week, honestly. And it's quite interesting, actually, because when you see my presentation, um, when they're talking about liking images and it being video content and photos, there's a theme to my presentation, which will all become clear. So, yeah, I'm, I'm a guilty millennial. It's all accurate. OK, so when I was thinking about what I wanted to say today, it's a great opportunity, and thank you for having me. Um, I was thinking, what do I want to say? I've got some fantastic people in this room. Great opportunity. Have a little think. I want to make sure it was appropriate and right. So, first thing that comes to mind is tell you about the company, of course. So I could stand here and I could tell you that there are 78,000 employees of the company and um, we've been going in the print industry since 1930. Um, I could tell you our turnover is over 18 billion euros globally. Um, but then I paused and I thought, I don't want to fall into that trap of waffling on about Fujifilm. It's boring. So I thought, OK, let's go back, have another thing. So I thought, OK, well, if, it's, if I want to talk about the company, I'll talk about the technology. Um, so again, I could talk about how we own our intelligence for print heads and ink systems, um, how we are award-winning when it comes to UV um, patents and, and technology. But again, I thought, I don't want to fall into that trap. Technology, not for today. So I went back to the drawing board, I thought, okay, R&D. This is how much of our global revenue we put back into R&D. It's our biggest focus. Um, one of the reasons you might hear of other suppliers and less of Fujifilm is that we don't put much into our marketing campaigns, which as a sales manager, slightly frustrating. <laughs> However, from your point of view, it's always much preferred that we put it into our intelligence and our technology and into our research and development at Tokyo level, then gets filtered down globally. Don't want to fall into that trap though, I'm not going to talk about that. So I'm back to drawing board again, and I thought, okay, so not the company. Not the technology, not the research and development, not the numbers. Let's talk about the product, our latest toys. Surely, this, is, this is, should be what I focus on. This is our partnership with Inca, their latest toy, which got launched just a few months ago. Still in development, so if you think you know Fujifilm, yeah, I spoke to them a few years ago, I know what they're about. You don't. Come and talk to us again. Got a new toy. And it's... it's Looking particularly, our main focus is looking at digital print, moving away from conventional printing, which can hold you back um, for all of these reasons. So I thought I'll stand here and tell you all of the positives of digital printing, because that's where the markets are going. We see it in many other markets that are helping make the transition from conventional print across to digital, so you can do the short run, variable data, all that snazzy stuff. All of this information I could tell you about our latest toy. But no. I don't want to fall into that trap. So I went back to the drawing board again, and I thought, what do I want to talk about? I don't want to send them to sleep. I don't want to be about numbers and figures today. I had a think, and I thought, I want to say hello. Hello. So many faces that I don't recognize in this room, which saddens me. I like to know people. I like to talk a lot, as you've probably figured out. I like pictures, again, millennial. Um, this is me, I am the Inkjet National Sales Manager for Fujifilm UK. This is my fourth time, I think. I came to the 100th celebration, what a party. Um, my colleague Sean was also with me at that conference, he isn't here today sadly, but you might recognise him as well. So we are both Fujifilm. Um, there's a couple more in my team, but these are probably us two are the ones that are the usual suspects at these events. Um, and we are well aware that your relationship with digital might not be the best. I think that some other digital suppliers may have brought things to market when it's not quite ready. I don't necessarily understand your requirements. That's why Fujifilm as a culture, as I've shown, we are all about R&D and all about partnerships. We're quite quiet as a company, quite modest. And I don't know why they employed me. Um, and we like to get to know our customers. So we're not going to come rocking up to you with all that product, all the numbers, all the information. We're great. We want to get to know you. Understand your businesses. Understand where you see your future going. What are the key points that your customers are missing out on that potentially our technology and our products could help you with? And if they can't do it now, what do you want to see 
for manufacturers in the future and how can we help you provide that. So Inca, who are the creators and, and incredibly intelligent, scarily intelligent people that are obviously based in Cambridge, where they all come from, um, you're more than welcome to come to Inca with Fujifilm, with myself and Sean, spend the day there, potentially organise something with SBA during the afternoon, come and see the products, talk to the incredible geniuses that are the brains behind it all, so we can make sure that we're not just bringing box products to try and shift at you, we're working with you to tailor make things. We've got a sale going on at the moment that it's going to be about six months before it can get to the customer site because it's being built from scratch with bespoke automation to handle all the media, big metal sheet media. It's all, it's not a normal sales process and I'm not here to sell to you. I'm here to make friends, hopefully, like me. Another millennial, millennial trait, millennial. Um, so you've known digital is coming for a while. I mean, I've stood up here and talked about it before. My boss, Andy Kent, he came here a few years ago. Digital's coming. It's here. We have installations globally. It's incredibly successful with some markets. Let's make that transition with you as well. Future-proofing. You said about this being all about the future, and that's what we want to do. We have some insights. We have some customer information that we can share with you. Understand where you see your future market heading and how we can fit in and support you make that change with us. So that's what I wanted to do. Have a shower, not a bath. So that's my contact details and my colleague Sean's as well. I'll leave some business cards at the back. I'm not going to talk anymore. That's the gist. Come and be friends with me, basically. That's all. Thank you.